Hey team, welcome back to EDF 6, where we are off to uh, the next day after fixing all the timey-wimey stuff. A new type of enemy has started to teleport the kaiju known as Urgenus. This massive monster must be their trump card. I can't stand these damn invaders. All right. Let's go! Destroy the invader! Storm one. You can In honor double. to see you. Eliminate the group of enemy ships before our air forces arrive. Urganus is in the path oh, of the hi. attack team. This is going to be over in a flash. Out of my way. All right, we got customized unit. Four stars. Which means it's piloted by Lieutenant Dan. Is it, is it just a blue barga? Step aside. You're in the way. Well, I'm going to shoot that thing now. I'll secure the path. Go. Relax. I won't step on our hero. I'll handle the Ergonus. You destroy the enemy ships. That makes sense. I can do that. Enemy ship has activated its teleporter. Shoot down the ship so they can't teleport more troops. Work in progress. I can only snipe them so fast. Ignore the kaiju. Take down the enemy ships. Prevent them from teleporting. The ship is its weak point. Wait for the front hatch to open and attack the shining part. Oh, I wonder who didn't know that. Was it me? Did I not know that? No, it wasn't me. I hate the fact that they're hiding behind buildings. And I don't have enough range. Has been defeated. Cool. Crush the target. That's Lieutenant Dan for you. Resource consumption is intense. Standing by. Urgen is approaching. I guess I'll take care of this. it's not so intense. You can't fight some more. Leave the Kaiju to Barga units. Bring down those enemy ships. All right. Holy shit. But why? Yo, Queen, what are you doing? Just please explode. What the hell? Why is that Queen being so obtuse? I don't I don't know why 
but I, I like why are they so tough how many rounds am I going to put into this son of a bitch that seemed unreasonable Let's go ahead, grab stuff plus things. I was assuming he'd be able to handle Ergonus. Ah, I just need to handle the other stuff, right? I think I'll eventually hit it if I just keep firing towards it. Lieutenant Dan, you, you, you're doing a disservice to our us Barga pilots. There we go. Wait, what the hell is over yonder? Urgenus eliminated! There you go. Lieutenant Dan does it again! Wait in the rear, Barga. Conserve your power. Let me check the damage. I'm coming down. Kaiju approaching. Kaiju incoming. You gotta be kidding me. Crap. Not again. Barga, prepare for battle operations. Three round burst, bitch. All right, let's have Lieutenant Dan out here. Let's, let's get rid of these assholes. And we'll roam around, soften up Ergonus if we can. I think he's got that. It's all lightweight. Lightweight, baby. Everybody wanna be a bodybuilder. But don't nobody wanna lift this heavy ass weight. Ronnie Coleman, circa sometime in the past. construction methodologies must have gotten amazing over the course of the years we destroy a building and it's popped back up the next day like magic That's probably good enough. Dude got up only to get knocked back down again. That's why I hate fighting in the Barga. Like the slightest thing knocks you down. That was cool.
No more time travel accidents. We will destroy the ring once and for all. All right, I'm digging this. E -D -R! All right, I can dig that. Let's go blow that bitch up. Operation Ring Gregor, Part 1. The attempts to alter history have failed, but I'm sure they'll try to regroup and do it again. We have to destroy the ring here. We know the ring's weakness. Taking one down is simple if we just can just send an attack unit right below it. But it seems they've finally figured out that out as well. They've increased the number of units guarding the ring. We'll move in via three routes in order to break through their defenses, forcing our way in from all three points at the same time. Even if one of our units can make it, we've won. Team one, let's go! Mr. Plot Armor needs to blow shit up! The ring's right there! We're first to arrive! Round one here! Seven clicks to the ring! Seven clicks to the ring! Partners will lead the way! We'll secure the path. Attack team fallen from behind. What if I just lead the way? I'll punch a hole in their defenses. Don't step on me, bro. Battle has broken out everywhere. Our diversion succeeded. All right. The ring is isolated. Now is the only time we can get close. Our goal is to break through enemy defenses and escort the attack team below the ring. The ring is actually a giant time machine. It's not made for battle like the mothership. Once the attack team arrives, victory is ours. The enemy's here! Enemy has strengthened their defenses. A much larger force than expected. Copper cannon ready. Infantry, stand back! I can't see shit. The time machine is made for a very specific purpose. It has little combat capability. That's a good uh, we know the ring's weak point. general assumption with no knowledge to back it up. As long as we can get below it, it can be destroyed by just a few units. I don't know, it seems to be able to summon arms of doom last I fought it. They should be, it should wipe them the hell out. they are, why would they not? Dude, are you kidding me? The primer ship can travel through time, going to the past and changing history. That's their strategy. Visitors from the distant future, that's what the primers really are. Think of the ring as a relay station. They needed to travel with exact precision across I get this years of history. They start in the future and go to any time period where the ring exists. From there, they seem to make small jumps of a few years at a time. Over the Barga and their aerial aerial without the ring, they can weakness a specific time. Their planned invasion relies on that degree of precision. Without it, their plan will crumble. You hope? I mean, I'm right there with you. I'm... We reach the end of a very long battle. In 50 years for me.
These battles are wild with the amount of shit around to pick up. Sons of bitches. Enemy robot units approaching. Uh, all right. It's the robots. They're here. <laughs> nah. They have a huge army. We can't prepare. How are we supposed to break through this? Shoot them. Uh, like like we do with everything. Shoot it. No, I'll aim for the body. Especially the ones with the damn missile launchers on them. Hurry! Support the attack team! Extermination team is here! You're late! Is this what you call full speed ahead? Multiple houses were destroyed! Even if we win, we're gonna get demoted! Leave career planning till after you've survived. I was gonna say, yeah. Uh, uh, how about we worry about, you know, the, the, sky. the whole Science winning detected. the war first might be the good way to go about that. Eliminate the flying enemies. Figured I'd eliminate the missile launching sons of bitches first. Force. Guess our surprise attack in small numbers backfired. All right, good shit. The ring's defenses are stronger than expected. Eliminate enemies before moving forward. The hell does it look like I'm doing? Group two here. Blocked by Kaiju and cut Vervin. Group three, engage the combat. Enemy garrison bigger than expected. Why is he wiggling? It's hilarious, <laughs> but why? Flying is approaching. More coming. Way more than the intel said. Uh, all right. Don't think about trying to break through. Destroy the enemies. I'm working on it as quickly as I damn well can. Shit! I'm not protecting the attack team. They're protecting me. That's okay. That's what I do. Drop ship coming down. It's a crew. crew you mean it's a dead? Worst place you could have landed. I am so sorry for your loss. Forget breaking through. Engage the enemy and protect yourself. That poor bastard. He jumped out that dropship. Expect them to have a defense like this. And he just had a shit show. Goes to show how important the ring is to the primes. It's their relay station for time travel. This does feel like a throw everything at the wall and hope it sticks strategy on their part. Chopped up the uh, a queen. Route three lost half our tanks, retreating. Okay, how does that Proteus and that Barger not have that thing dead? Enemy 
ships are gathering in the sky overhead. Holy shit. Wow. Okay. The enemy released an anchor. They seem to be surrounding the attack team. Well, all right. A teleportation device. They've got us surrounded. Shit. We didn't break through their defenses. We walked straight into a trap. Well, it feels like it. At this point. All units, engage. Protect yourselves. Enemies are appearing out of the anchor. I mean, I would kind of expect them to. We can't if we don't get rid of that anchor. Aim for the top and destroy it. Aim for the anchor. Destroy it. Eh, that'd be fine. In major trouble. Unit one. Majorly damaged. Withdrawing. Unit two cannot go on. Retreat it. Really? Ugh. How much of a beating can you take? Think they figured out their diversion scheme? Possibly. Primers do have a certain ability to know the future. We should keep that in mind. Fargo one taking serious damage. Unit three, major damage. I'm out. Which one's spawning the excavators? Because those are my least favorite, of course. Attack team has taken devastating damage. The attack team is in no condition to fight. We're about to be annihilated. That one soldier is still fighting. Facing this many enemies is a lot. Yeah, it is. Please don't die. Oh, That's I mean. all I ask. No big. But there are no units to provide relief. I was gonna, no matter what. Well, thanks for showing up, guys. Miss my opportunity there to kill it. God, it's the mother monster. Uh, kill that. Kill that immediately. Kill it with fire. Kill it with a lot more fire. Okay, we're good. We're mostly good. I think we mostly calmed it down. Cool down the system. Holy shit. Yeah, there we go. Got him. Clean house a little bit. There's so much green on this map. Oh crap.
Okay. Let's go ahead and try to clean up what we can. Roughly, anyway. I need everything. I'll be here all day. Once you get into range, stabilizer, sensors detected enemies. I mean, there's shit all over the place. Be here all day if I do that. Proteus teams have taken severe losses. Cannot continue fighting. The attack team has taken too much damage. The plan is a failure. The hell it is. Storm one is safe. We can pull this off. No. The other attack teams were destroyed. There's no one to offer backup. I don't need backup. I am the backup Listen, of the backup. You're dealing with an expert at this strategy. Storm One has taken down the ring over and over again. Just provide support. Okie dokie. That was a wild one. It's like here, leopard, leopard guided rocket launcher. Use it, bitch. I'm about to. I'm about to at that rate. I'm not a fan of the B. The B pisses me off. Operation Ring Cracker Part 2. Roots 2 and 3 have been annihilated. Only Route 1 have made it. Fortunately, you're with with them. You're a pro when it comes to this operation. Go and destroy the weakness. The weakness. It must be destroyed. One kilometer to the ring. I'll back you up. So we're the only ones that made it through the encirclement. We're the only ones could keep up with the chief. Eliminate the drones! Good call immediately on this sniper rifle, holy shit. We were gathered here today. This must be fate. There's no backup. We'll rely on the storm team. Approaching the ring! Multiple drones around the ring! Son, now what the hell are you doing already? The ring seems to have activated. 
So that thing's a time machine. All right, what the hell's it doing though? Drones are coming out of the ring. Enemy ships appearing from the ring. We believe that the ship came from the future. A ship that travels across time. A time machine. A ship from a hundred thousand years in the future. It requires the ring act as a waypoint in order to avoid a disaster that would span the infinite stretches of time. In order to maintain their forces, they have to be able to travel to exact points in time. Okay. Traveling a hundred thousand years is sure to lead to errors in calculation. That's why they need the ring. It's not as powerful as the Fang, of course, but ease of use is amazing. One more hurrah. Dude. You got two shields, you don't need to jump around like a rabbit. The weak spot is directly beneath it. Get closer. Oh, is the weak spot directly beneath it? I'm i I'm, I'm glad you were here to tell me that. I don't know what I would have done otherwise. No, our job is just a beginning. I'm working on it. Show me what you got. We must believe that we will win. Only few we need thy people's eyes. Try your best. Yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. All right, let's clean up whatever's left. God damn, like hole. Good. You squeaky bastard. I will follow the plan. Round up. Yes, sir. Shoot the laser. Shoot the laser. You enter the ring. Okay. I'll be the one who kills the most enemies. Weapon system. You is coming. Round up. That's glowing red. Oh no, shit. The red part is probably a control unit. If it breaks, they'll lose control of the time machine and it will self destruct. You hope. You should have a lot of confidence in these non tested theories. Has anybody blown up a time ship before? I don't think it's going to be this easy, but here we are. Oh, 
devices. At half damage. We won't go back in time now. The accident was just a fluke. It won't happen again. I'm glad you're certain of this. I don't There's know no how. What happens from here on. I keep blasting it with my battle rifle, I guess. You sure we're not going back in time? It feels very timey wimey. You did it. You destroyed the ring. Humanity wins. Well, what if I told you a ring has 360 degrees? The ring has started tilting. It's losing balance. It's and if I flash. were to put a control point on one side, it's crashing. Storm team, get out of there. Why would not I not make it symmetrical? And put a control point on three other sides. The ring, the ring is rotating. It seems to be rolling top over bottom. You mean ass up, face this is down? News to me. Or was so it, if it weren't for that accident, face we down, never ass taken down up? The ring. Oh, there's a red thing on the bottom part of the ring. It's just like the control unit we destroyed. So the ring has two control units. At least, I would assume four, since you know it's a circle. Our target is the second control unit. Attack the glowing red part. Calculating position based on diameter and angle. Five hundred meters to the new weak spot. All right. Oh no, it's going to be the cannon has been deployed from the ring. Intel was correct, but we didn't foresee the timing. Evolved enemy ship detected. Oh, okay. Oh, that's cool. Where are they the at? enemy is activating their teleportation devices. Well, that's immediately enough of that. Yes, sir. Androids are coming down from the ring. Holy shit, this is gonna get rough. They probably want to eliminate ground units to protect the ring. That would be a wise assumption. I mean, it's a good strategy. They're sending in one weapon after another. All to defend the ring, I imagine. I should have used the uh, leopard guided rocket launcher, shouldn't I? That cannon continues to function even after being partially destroyed. It must be completely obliterated to be stopped. It's a work in progress. So you're we have to take the whole thing out. Once partially destroyed, it will stop attacking to reconfigure. That's its only weakness. Expected. We can't handle much more. Now nah, we're fine. We still got a soldier yet fighting. Successfully destroyed the control unit. Taking up a second one should be doable too. Things aren't looking very good though. We've got an expert at this strategy. Yes, I was thinking the same thing. Well, first and foremost, I'd like, I'd like to stop exploding, please. That's my, that's my most bigliest desire right now. Please stop making me explode.
Intel is coming in fast. Appears to be an evolved enemy ship. Why? Damn it. The situation is looking bad. We might need to prepare for the worst. My HP bar? I never imagined it would turn off like this. Yeah, not great. Not particularly great. Alright. And, uh... Let's see, who am I to argue? So there's a good bit of damage. But I'm just... I like bullets getting there immediately. You know what I mean? Routes 2 and 3 have been annihilated. Only Route 1 made it. Fortunately, you're with them. You're a pro when it comes to this operation. Okay. Okay, butter me up. One kilometer to the ring. You lead. I'll so we're you. the only ones that made it through the encircled. We're, we're, we're the only ones that could keep up with the chief. <laughs> Overcompensated. We were gathered here today. This must be fate. There's no backup. We'll rely on the storm team. Approaching the ring. Multiple drones around the ring. Eliminate the drones. <laughs> What are we getting? The Arms already? Activated. So that thing's a time machine. Drones are coming out of the ring! That it? They're just gonna spawn drone? Okay, there it goes. Alright, uh, oh, no, not the arm. Enemy ships appearing from the ring! We believe that the ship came from the future. A ship that travels across time. A time machine. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna blow this up a real quick. Years in the future. It requires the ring act as a waypoint in order to avoid a disaster that would span the infinite stretches of time. In order to maintain their forces, they have to be able to travel to exact points in time. Traveling a hundred thousand years is sure to lead to errors in calculation. That's why they need the ring. I'm glad we've all become experts in time travel suddenly. Shit! It's a massive arc! It's the same as always, Captain. We get ahead, then fall behind again. Over there, too! They say we have a guardian angel! A reader of the battlefield! Get out together! Get out together! Dude. With the, the slow pisses me off more than anything, I think. The weak spot is directly beneath it. Get closer. Cute. I'll worry about that when I have a chance to. There, give it a second. Let me let me let me work it out. I don't know. I figured two Gatling guns was better. Most of the time I was playing. Maybe most of the time I was wearing power armor, my guys. That's a good deal of flying hours. Maybe. I don't know. Destroy that 
part that's glowing red. The red part is probably a control unit. If it breaks, they'll lose control of the time machine and it will self-destruct. Made impact with the control unit. Made impact with his face. He got it rolled. Holy shit, okay. Control unit at half the damage. The was just a fluke. It won't happen again. There's no knowing what happens from here on. I'm impressed. We go back to the future. Wing successfully destroyed. You did it. I don't think it's going to be that easy, you though. The ring. Humanity wins. I get this feeling that it's not going to be that easy. It's losing balance. Yeet. It's going to crash. It's crashing. Storm team, get out of there. The ring is spinning. Well, if I had to guess for a ring... The ring is rotating. It seems to be rolling top over bottom. You mean face down, ass this up? That's the me. way we like to... So if it weren't for that accident, we never could have taken down the ring. Well, I'm assuming there is another control point directly the across. The ring. It's just like the control unit we destroyed. And then I'm assuming there'll be one over there and one over there, because, so the you know... Two control units. Super symmetry in all four sides, yada yada, as you were. Alright, is that over there and blow it up? I'm assuming it won't be that easy. Our old buddy, back again. Our intel was correct, but we didn't foresee the timing. Oh, 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 that 1900 clip. Or 19k clip. The enemy is activating their and this is why devices. I like penetrating weapons. Damn. Are coming down from the ring. Grenadiers. Alright. Android Grenadiers incoming. They probably want to eliminate ground units to protect the ring. So their strategy is to go straight to the explosives. Why not? Seems legit. They're sending in one weapon after another. All to defend the ring, I imagine. Oh, come on, bullshit. That cannon continues to function even after being partially destroyed. It must be completely obliterated to be stopped. So you're saying we have to take the whole thing out? Yeah, that's fine. Once partially destroyed, it will stop attacking to reconfigure. That's its only weakness. All right. Good shit. Let's clean these bastards up. We still got a soldier yet fighting. Successfully destroyed the control unit. Taking out the second one should be doable too. Oh, well, I'm glad you understand my abilities. Okay. 
We're good. We're still cleaning. We're still cleaning. Situation is looking bad. We might need to prepare for the worst. Now we're fine. I never imagined it'd turn out like this. Fine, we just pick up the health kits. I heal everybody up. Time. What made it in time? Now within range for submarine carrier support. Oh, we're about to get some cruise missiles, boys. Epimetheus coming to surface. Enemy ship within firing range. Epimetheus deploying weapons. Which explains why they're not doing anything. Preparing to fire. Taking aim. Let's go. Pandora taking aim. Siren taking aim. All right, bring the thunder. Submarine carriers launch triple strike. Epimetheus now firing. Pandora now firing. Siren now firing. Ready for battle. Everyone stay alert. Yes, yes sir. sir. Entering the range. Hooked up. The reaction is close. Stop. Yes, sir. I'll show you what I have. Check. Try getting hit by three submarine carriers at once. Those are some big old missiles. It feels like they would be doing more damage. All right, good shit. Let's go. It is more damage per second, I think, to do this. Also, why do I feel like we're not done? We did it. The ring's done for. Woo woo. Oh wait, broken, broken, broken. Okay, never mind. I guess we might be done. Whoop, whoop. The ring has lost balance. It's crashing. Evacuate fast. The ring's crashing. We is won. It? I mean, this is probably one of the two the best places to be instead of under it. Either inside or outside. The Take ring pick. somehow didn't crash. It's struggling to maintain balance. I assume it'll have something to do with him. So it can still fly? For it. The ring has stopped at the horizon. Oh, that's a lot of arms, isn't it? Sure he is. Multiple cannons have appeared. All right, well, let's just chop them down like we normally do. We could deploy so many cannons at once. Attack the cannons. This is more than we can deal with. This thing's got incredible defenses. What the hell? Yo, what the hell? Let go. Stop. What the fuck? Look at their weapons. We'd better be extremely careful. What the hell was that horse shit? Thing wiped out half of my health bar. 
green glowing point. Dude, how many shots can it take? Holy shit. The reaction is close. The thing took like four or five shots. Oh my god, I missed. It's wild that those things can take that much damage. Not my building. What I could use is a health kit, though. Okay. Look, it's deploying the spinel. I would thusly assume I am supposed to shoot that. The spinel. But I gotta take care of these green things first. Floating in the middle of the ring. The outer wall of the spinel is open. It's the first time this has ever been observed. Considering its central location, it must be an important device. And since it's currently activated, that means the time machine is in an unstable condition. The device yeah, is probably blow it up. Power, and thereby keeping the time machine functional. That's the most sensible explanation. If that's true, the spinel is the ring's weak point. So if we destroy the spinel, the ring will fall. Is that what you mean? Well, yeah, we're gonna worry about these green things first, though. Aim for the floating object at the center of the ring. No That's thanks. Weak point. We'll get there. Don't Try worry. Shoot inside when the spinel is deployed. Let me work. Goddamn blue orbs as well. When the spinel opens, attack the inside. No, I will do what I want. Let's keep your guard up. Where's the purple ones? What was the blue ones shooting the orbs of bullshit? The little lasers? No, I don't care about those. Those are whatever. Those are adorable. Those are like, we're going to be big lasers when we grow up one day. But this thing, this thing wipes out half my health bar. And the other things juggle me around, and I don't like it. Yes, sir. Hey, you know what? That's fine by me. Sure has. Fine. Their defenses are solid. The ring's not supposed to be a battleship, right? We shouldn't underestimate what the ring can do. They've been keeping an arsenal of weapons in the future to protect their precious ring. But these are emergency measures. This isn't how the time machine is supposed to be used. It's a time machine. It can have be used however the hell the however the hell they want to use it. It's just the only limit is their creativity. This is going to take a while, isn't it?
I could probably try to just dunk on the uh, center part and end it quick. But I feel like that might push whatever the hell it's going to do next. Could be completely wrong. Oh yeah, we're gonna be shooting this bitch for a while, huh? Oh hell no, what is this? Round two. Are you kidding me it's right now? The basic shape is the same. We can assume that it will also continue to function once partially destroyed. But then it will need time to reconfigure itself. Oh boy. No, sir, I don't like it. See shit. We'll assume the green orb is the problem there. Yep. The shelling is too severe. We need backup. And still. One soldier is out there fighting, even now. But it's just a matter of time. Sure he is. Jesus. Helicopters are headed to this area. All right, that seems not so wise. Zozo. We flew 400 kilometers just to meet the hero. Cool, hi, how you doing? The was one for the history books. By the order of our commander in chief, Commando T, joining forces. They're from America? Commando 1, descending. Stop taking my buildings, damn it. Commando 2, descending. Commando three, descending. Yeah. Initiating combat. Here we go. Form a shield around the hero. Protect the hero. Humanity is indebted to that well, soldier. Well, at Don't least I'm not appear. dead. Good, one one down. What I could use is some Healy kits and not getting shot. Remove the safety device. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Stop shaking. 
Who made this stupid plan? Are they trying to get themselves killed? Welcome, Lieutenant. Hope you'll help us out. Divert their attention. That's all we need to do. shots then Chopping them down. Focus them, focus it, focus them, focus it. Oh, eventually when? The time machine is reaching its limit. The ring will break soon. Hopefully sooner rather than later. I have unlimited ammo, but uh, so do they. Uh oh, okay, okay, now what? The time machine's emitting a strange light. What's going on? What is going on? The time machine's beginning to lose control. Okay. Enemies appearing from the ring. Oh, hell no. The future primers are falling into chaos. They're sending any troops they can get their hands on. Storm team, the enemy is heading down. Oh, hell no. Somebody's having a good time. Tag it? We didn't tag it enough. All right. I'm just gonna sit here. Confirm distance with the enemy. Make them come to us, if anything. Pray that some bitch opens. Shoot them once they're in range. Take them down when they get closer. Prepare to shoot. Yes, sir. Remove spears, safety devices. Yes, sir. Too far into the range. Too far. Throw them in. Just explode, damn it. Spinel majorly damaged. Finally, the ring will crash at last. Please just explode. Yeah, show me what you got. We really did it. Holy crap. Something's wrong with the ring. It's gonna crash. The ring is coming down! Their plan is over. Humanity has won. Well done. Storm Team, thank you for your hard-fought win. Really and truly. I never thought this day would really come. But here it is. It really is. Wait a minute. There's Wait a minute. Uh, there we go. What's that? Pepsi Man. A hole in the sky. A wormhole. A hole of worms. Oh, that looks cool. Follow me. 
It's a danger noodle. Those glowy bits look important. But... I guess we'll come back to that in a second. Minion Blast. Alright, let's see what it is we're getting into. The Scales of Time. A colossal ship has appeared. Showed up in the sky out of nowhere. This thing is massive as the ring, but it moves at a terrifying speed. The enemy should be experiencing errors with their time travel now that the ring has been destroyed. But if that thing managed to appear here at this very moment, it must have capabilities equivalent to the ring, or possibly even greater. Dun, dun, dun. I assume this is the end. That thing is officially our enemy. All units. Oh, no shit. It must be from the future, too. It can see the future. We think that's the Primus ship for time travel. They had this and the ring. Holy shit. Okay, so that thing in the mouth, maybe? Should either retreat or hide. Yeah, probably hide. We're actually going to use our bunker wall here, as it is. I, I think our bunker enough. wall is impervious to damage. It's over one kilometer. A giant ship beyond anything seen so far. No matter, I'm a very oh. long range weapon will be necessary to shoot it from the ground. Um, uh, I got that equipped, it in moves fact. It's faster than its appearance would suggest. It might be hard to land attacks from the ground. Okay, well that's cute. It's too far for my attacks to reach. It's too far. I can't shoot it. I can't tell what the hell's going on. So we're we're all in the same boat here. There's something like a cannon on the side of the ship's bow. Attack the cannon. Aim for the side of the ship's bow. The hell did you think I was doing? Destroy them. If I don't miss, it is most certainly their time travel ship. So they had two mother ships. Not exactly. They only had the ring up to a certain point in time. Why do you say that? Time is fucking. This is from the future after they made the ring. They sent this from ten, a uh, hundred. Who knows how many years later? What? The Primers who sent the ring must have shared their failure. That's why they made a new ship for time travel afterwards, whether 10 or 100 years later. So, it's from the post ring future? Can you all get the fuck out of my line of sight? It must be made with even more advanced technology than the ring. Truly fearsome. Hold on. So if we destroy this, won't they just send something else from even further in the future? Yes. In another ten or hundred years, the Primers will make a new weapon and send it to... I mean, make it really obvious for me, why don't you? What the hell? Ship's head has been hit! We're not just fighting the Primers from a certain era. We're fighting all primers that ever existed. All primers from every period in time. I mean, it looks cool. There's no way we can win. I'm not sure it's effective. They'll try though. again, no matter how many times they lose. The war will continue for an eternity until the primers win. What's humanity supposed to do? Victory is technically impossible. Well, the cannon on the bow seems to be the primary one. Yeah, yeah it it's does. Like the head of a dragon. It 
It may look like the mouth of a dragon, but it's probably armor to protect the opening for firing the cannon. There should be an area with weak protection around the firing device. In other words, the mouth is the weak point. Enemy ship slightly damaged. There's a teleportation device on the side of the ship. There was. The ship's head is the weak point. Aim for inside of the mouth. Until there wasn't. Drones appearing from enemy ship. Bro, I don't even know what we can do here. This thing's just slow and obnoxious. Just use our bunker. Use our bunker for cover. Bunker for cover, baby. I mean, I put this round we through really its noggin. Amazing! We really won! Okay, that wasn't that big of a deal, to be honest. The mothership fight was harder. Mm. I have a feeling we're not done yet. Pepsi man. What happened? No way. What the hell is that? Pepsi man. Like an alien. This is going to learn today. Don't tell me it's there. God. What? A god. Down from oh, can you shoot the rocks? Oh, if you can shoot the rocks, you're about to have a really bad day. That is a god. Eh. Don't be stupid. Shut with him. I love him. There was wreckage from an alien spacecraft discovered in the mountains of India All right, thousands cool. of years ago. That's why the EDF was created. Well, now they're gonna buy. Now they're playing the, the fuck around and find out game. Earth for a very, very long time, humanity believed them to be gods and created legends about them. Eh. Mediocre. We knew the Primus civilization had lasted for thousands of oh, years. Oh, hi, Froggy Boy. But now it hits home that they really traveled across time to get here. They should have stayed in, in their words, time. The gods are still alive today. For the prior species, it's an important entity. Irreplaceable. Well, then Whatever let's kill this it. Entity is, we have to fight it. With if fire. To survive. It plays with the light and dances in the sky. Just like the legends say. Damn you buildings, get the fuck out of the way. Now what's here? Not the buildings though. Launch Operation Omega. Okay, what's that? You can't be serious. Why? Are you really prepared to do this? Do really? what? Please stop. Anything but that. What is it? So many lives will be lost. Can you allow that to happen? What do you intend to do? 
our one and only last resort. A rocket loaded with hazardous chemical substances was sent to Mars. We will detonate it. Okay, so why is that a problem for some people? Why would you do that? To destroy our future foes. That's his proposed plan. Turnabout is fair play. The rocket contains a mass amount of toxic pollutants. Once they spread and seep into the soil over the years, it will affect the course of evolution. Poison that cannot be purified. It should have a major impact on life there. Life will most likely be unable to evolve. Or, even if it does, it will be different than what we've seen. Yo, bro, you're... It'll be like the primers bro never existed. Got, bro got brutal. He's like, all right, you want to fuck around? Right Time to... Just combatants, but the entire species and civilians. Do we have the right to do such a thing? Are we in the middle of a genocide? I'm with that guy. Yo, science bro got brutal. All right. Mad respect. They are now. If we hesitate, they'll be killed again. The war is going in humanity's favor. Everyone thinks so, but it's not. My wife was killed over and over again. Over and over and over. Millions, if not billions of people have been killed. We have to make them pay. Revenge the, the dish best served Mars. however the fuck the you want to serve it. Sequence. This is why they want to destroy humanity. Once you know the future, it becomes possible to change it. The primers never should have let us find out they exist. Yep. Fatal error. They fucked up. In the flow of time, there are always infinite future possibilities. A small change in the past can change the future dramatically. There is no set outcome. The primers essentially dug a hole beneath their own feet. They've been playing with the possibility of erasing their own existence. After thoroughly enjoying their little travels through time, they finally realized it. And then they grew afraid. Because things had gotten to a point where they couldn't be pieced back together. So that's why they want to eradicate humanity. That, that's fair. And it's why we shall eradicate them. Thusly instead. Get your ass down here, you son of a bitch. Blur. Blur. Yeah, what the hell's he doing? Squid boys on the field. Squid boy down. Squid boy two down. Boy, three down. Nope, not down yet. Getting there. Give me a second. Let me cook. Really? Can I not blow those up? Or am I missing my shot?
Damn it. Only one shot at a time is going to take forever to kill him. Okay. I guess we just go in for the kill. Be the smart thing to do. Tag it from that range. What's your purpose? I hate you. How can we lose you such powerful heavy armaments? Really? Yes. Don't depend too much on three men. Ignition in three, two, one. Kaboom! Kaboom! Pollutants are spreading. The future has changed. The primer civilization no longer exists. Alright. But our enemies, they're still here. It's very strange. Primers are erased from history. They should be extinct. Highly abnormal. What just happened? Don't know. Far from extinct. They've grown even stronger. Ow! Ow! Ah, you gotta be fucking kidding, man. Wild. Wild. I don't know what it's about to do, but I'm concerned. Oh, bullshit. Come on. If I could see what the hell was going on. Got it. More aliens. Bro. Oh my god. I see. So this thing has become the embodiment of all primers. What? Yeah, I'm with you on this guy. Launching an attack on Mars created a definitive contradiction in the timeline. If primers don't exist, the war wouldn't have happened and humanity wouldn't have nuked Mars. Then the primers would have ended up being born on Mars and attacking humanity. A paradox. We're, we're three levels removed on the paradox. In order to return to normal, time must choose a side. Humanity or the primers. Why do you say that? One remains Plot. and one is gone, thus removing the contradiction. You're saying time itself is going to erase either them or us? Uh, exactly. I don't like this, so we're just going to run away. 
It is the one selected by time. The very embodiment of the primers. Who survives and who goes extinct. Now is the time to decide. Oh, I'm gonna choose us. If we lose, humanity disappears. Androids appearing from enemy ships. Uh, Android detected. He twisted his fucking spawny shit out of my line of sights. What a dick bag. The enemies were cut out of the flow of time. Ghosts with no home to return to. Get rid of them. Then everything will be finished. Far away. Nope, just gotta get my timing down. This is crazy long. Holy shit. I suppose I could just be trying to headhunt him and just go for the kill. Not that shit again. Gotta be coming to the end. Kraken are coming. They're like ghosts who've been removed from the flow of time. If they continue to exist, a time paradox will occur. So go exercise them. Do I look like I'm part of the Ghostbusters? Do I look like I'm a priest? Technically worried, it's just Bro, it's so just long and tedious. I don't even know what's going on right now. Nothing like it being inside the mob, so I can't attack it. On your marks. Yes, yes, sir. You said this is the primer selected by time, right? Yeah. Exactly. Ever since the primers interfered with human history, the time paradox has been intensifying. At that point, you were chosen as the person who would take on the burden of representing humanity. You are the one. The representative of humanity across time. Too many effects, man. Too many effects. Calm the shit down with the effects. I'd like to be able to see for more than, you know, four seconds at a time. If this operation succeeds, we can change the result. Safety devices. Yes, sir. I swear we're wing divers made. I'll show you my move. Ready to fight. Yes, sir. Everyone, stealers. Yes, sir. I'll show you 
Pepsi man It's finally over The contradiction has been removed History has been corrected and things will stabilize Time chose humanity Well no I chose humanity The primers are no By driving How will humanity walk forth now magnetic accelerated to slugs to into its head. You changed everything. I give you my deepest gratitude. Okay. Me too. Thank you. You're welcome, Borotato Chip. I really appreciate it. Thanks, science lady. Thank you so much. No, you so shut much. up. Go away. You saved me. You saved my life. We did the thing. Wing divers are the best unit. Isn't this operation real sort of messy? Too. That's right. Isn't this operation kind of messy? Yeah, yeah, one would define it as such. At last, the battle is over. The planet is awash. In mourning, humanity has lost 30% of its total population. But we also gained something. Primers bought their science and technology. With their advanced knowledge, the human race is sure to make leaps and bounds. The primers are gone, and no more will come from Mars. Knowing the future, humanity is ready to take the next step. I saw it. Our world dying, people dying, over and over again. And yet, I still said it, there is a hope. There is hope. Chaos will come to an end. Evil will not spread, and violence will not prevail. New justice shall be hailed, and order shall be returned to the people. None of that was wrong. That's exactly what happened. We knew this would happen all along. Why? Because you are here. Protector of the people. Defender of peace. And champion of this planet. You are. E.D.F. Alright, that explains why they were so, you know, we got to murderize you. I can dig it. At least there was a reason. Um, and we won. Whoop. But, uh, we're gonna go ahead and escape that. You can now select the hardest and infernal difficulties from your current save. Enjoy. Uh, I think for the time being, that's going to be a whole lot enough of that. I enjoyed it. Shenanigans of just cheesy sci-fi kablau kablaus. But uh, we'll be back either to do the DLCs or something else. Until then, y'all stay safe and have a good one.